God's fingerprint. Now what is this God's fingerprint all about? There are about 6.5 billion people on the face of this earth. However, we all have a unique and different fingerprint. In about 1280, Fibonacci, a scientist, discovered a sequence of numbers which created a very interesting pattern. The sequence began with the number 1 and this is how he received the sequence. He just added two numbers and got the next number. So 1 plus 1, 2, 2 plus 1, 3, 3 plus 2, 5, 5 plus 3, 8, 8 plus 5, 13, 13 plus 8, 21, 21 plus 13, 34, and it goes on indefinitely. A rectangle formed with the length and breadth of any two numbers of this sequence forms what is known as the golden rectangle, the perfect rectangle. So I want you all to remember the golden rectangle which can be broken down into squares of the size of the next Fibonacci number. So if you look at this particular golden rectangle, it can be broken down into smaller squares which has the Fibonacci numbers, whether it's 1 or 2 or 3 or 5 or 8. Now, if we take a golden rectangle and break it down into smaller squares based on the Fibonacci numbers and divide each with an arc, the patterns begin to take shape. We begin to see the Fibonacci spiral. So, if we start with the smallest square and we just draw an arc, Go to the next square, draw an arc. Go to the next one, draw an arc. Go to the next one, draw an arc. Go to the next one, draw an arc. Next one, an arc. So you see this? This is the pattern which is formed. Starting from the center, it keeps going outwards, forms a spiral. We often get this particular symbol, which is a symbol of creation. This is creation energy when we do automatic writing or channeling. Now the importance of this spiral is where we find it. Whether we look at our DNA or we look at a sunflower or a pineapple, the currents of the ocean, the waves that bring in the tide, the starfish, the shells or even the spirals of the galaxies above us, they all show this particular sequence which is also called the golden ratio or the God's fingerprint. It is also called fractal nature of reality. So this is also called fractal nature of reality. So remember, whenever you're receiving spirals like this, starting from a center point, slowly moving outwards, this is creation energy, and this is how the Fibonacci sequence looks like. So that's all for today. Thank you so much.